Hi, welcome to the worst show in the world. <laughs> Today. Today. I am here with some sort of cool people. We're filming here. Can you can you can you stop doing your makeup? Okay, wait. Someone texted me, sorry. Girls. I don't even think they're rolling. Are you rolling? Of course the man's rolling. <laughs> That's what he does. I know. Today we are here doing a little talk talk show. And um, I have some amazing guests here. Half of them are amazing. Um, There's two of us. <laughs> oh, yeah. So half of them are amazing. This is Natalie here, say hi. Hi. Um, this is Tati here. Hi. And this is how we do our shows nowadays. We're gonna talk and play games and have fun. Is that cool with y'all? Mm -hmm. Like COVID-20 nowadays, not a lot of fun going on. Mm -hmm. And I just think talking Close to close since we've been tested and all that's gonna be great. Yeah. Yep. Yeah? That's what I was thinking. You guys vibing? Yeah. yeah. I'm vibing. I'm vibing. Alright guys. So question, um, if you could drive any car to like a red car, if you could pull up in any way, you wouldn't be driving, of course. You'd have a personal driver. If you could pull up to a red carpet in any car, what would it be? My Jeep Wrangler. Uh a Chevy Camaro? <laughs> My Jeep Wrangler is so pretty, you have no idea. But I'm talking, you're pulling up to... Yeah, in my Jeep No, you're pulling up to the Hunger Wait, Games premiere. Wait, what is That's a week. <laughs> what? You never heard of one of those? <laughs> have you been quarantined that long and you forgot what Apparently, that is? Apparently, it's like touching me. Um, so if you pulled up to the Hunger Games premiere, you're going to pull up... And you're pulling up with well, the main girl, whatever her name Wasn't is, Wasn't Hunger Games like five years ago? Weren't yeah. you like five years ago? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Five years ago, I hope you guys know Hayden was like seven. I was. <laughs> I was 10 actually. Okay, but I don't know, for some reason like red carpet, just like Jeep and a Mustang, or Camaro, whatever you said. Or, just, or, okay, okay. I'm talking like Rolls, okay. Cadillac. A McLaren or an Aston Martin. But everyone, those are respectable. Everyone else is gonna pull up in those cars, so I don't wanna pull up. So, so you're gonna, gonna pull up in a Jeep where. Exactly, so they'll be like, who is pulling up in that? And everyone will no, look No, no me. one's, no. They're not even gonna look at you. It's so, like so it's, it's, it's like so beachy. Like, it catches someone's eye, even if it's like in a good or bad way. Catch I would eye. pull up in the Maybach G Wagon. Brand new. Thing is crazy. crazy okay, right? Dr. Phil, next question. All right, um, you know what, security, get her out of here. We don't, me and Natalie decided we just can't have her here anymore. Just wrap it's her up. It's a love-hate relationship. Wrap her up. You'll get used COVID to it. COVID-20. So, yeah, today we're gonna play a little game. It's called Would You Rather. Um, so, would you rather jump off the Eiffel Tower or jump off a really tall building? Well, isn't the Eiffel Tower really the <laughs> Yeah. I feel like both would have the same Oh ending. no, yeah, they would both equal out to the same. It's just what would you rather look at last, Eiffel Tower the or I just a really tall building? The Eiffel Tower. See, I don't know, I just thought the really tall building would be prettier. You're in Paris. I was in Paris for the first time. My dad had to drag me out of the hotel to go look at the Eiffel Tower. Damn. I don't know why. I'm really S thinking about this one because I don't have an answer. Are you really, see, it, because, it like, worries me that you were thinking about it so hard. Here's the thing. I wouldn't want to jump off of a building. Yeah. But like, technically, the Eiffel Tower is not a building. It's a tower. I don't <laughs> want to jump off of the tower either. Would you rather own a sports car or a luxury vehicle? If you What's know the, your thing with cars today? If you know the difference. My Jeep Wrangler. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm going to give COVID-20 if she says one more time. Wait, am I looking at this one Ow. or this one? <gasps> You're not looking at what? It's okay. What? Are, looking at what? It's a, just a forget camera. it. Just forget it. What camera? <laughs> You're supposed. To, they're not supposed to know it's being filmed and talked to them. We're just having a normal <laughs> conversation, and they're supposed to feel like they're here. Okay. Okay. Like, I was just like connecting you, with this one. I thought you've been in this industry for like eight years. Like, I have. You should realize that. You're supposed to make them feel like they're here. Even though it's their screen, they're not supposed to know that. All right, um, would you rather eat a sandwich full of crickets or a sandwich full of cockroaches? What's the difference? Yeah. <laughs> one's gonna be a little less gutty, maybe a little more crisp. The other one's gonna be bigger, like chunks, more like chicken instead of like sliced up fajitas. 
and it's gonna probably have a little more juice. Are they like? Cooked? I hope you know or that not? I will never have fajitas again. So you're gonna have that the chicken, so like crazy. the cockroach, like the big chunky one. The, the fajitas was the crickets, like how they're like skin, like okay. small. You if know? I have to pick, then I guess crickets. I was about to say same. Yeah. But like they're, they're cooked, right? Like, they're not jumping around. Like. No, I, I like the feeling where you can feel them like ripping or like <laughs> jumping down your throat. It's kind of cool. It's like a little bounce house. Doink, doink. Mm. Uh, do you like sushi? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. So. You like crickets. <laughs> That's interesting. But not as interesting as like. Fish. You. You're like really interesting. Interestingly weird, you know? Mm. Okay, Tati, this is your job now. Okay. Or, no, actually, no, stop. Natalie, go ahead. Okay. It's your show. Would you rather- Welcome to the Natalie show. Hello. Yeah! yeah. Woo! Would you rather mm -hmm. never be able to walk again or never be able to brush your teeth? Never be able to brush my teeth. I'll just stack with gum, like <laughs> stack. I guess, yeah, but I would hate, I would feel so, I would feel so like um, self-conscious, like if I never brush my teeth. So like, you would rather never walk? No, but I would I would rather walk, but I would like, if I couldn't ever brush my teeth again, I would probably just never leave Mouthwash my Mouthwash isn't considered brushing your teeth. <laughs> so I would use mouthwash. That's, that's true, actually. Yeah, but that doesn't clean your teeth still. But but it somewhat does. So in about two years, you're gonna have little things coming out, and they're like broken. That's and fine. I can out. get veneers, but I don't. Oh want respect! I'd rather yeah, because I, anyway, I can get I veneers. Like walking. I take an hour walk every day. Wow. I can't do it. Do I take two steps, there. and the only time I really walk is from my fridge to my gaming computer. If you had an Apple Watch, it would really, really be. It would really your add steps. Up. Yeah. And you know what? You know what's great is. Eating motivates me to walk because I get so hungry. I'm like, dang, I have to crazy? walk to get food. You just exercised and then it was like, for what? Shouldn't you eat the food and then take a walk? But it's like I exercise, well, but he, there's nothing to build with when eating, I don't he eat. eating, he exercised by like grabbing the chip and like putting it in his mouth. Yeah, like I, no, yeah, like I have to walk I mean, five steps to grab the food. Otherwise, I would just never walk. Some people got it like that and I'm proud of you. I curl my donut to my mouth. Cut the camera. The sound effect. <laughs> Cut the camera. Scott, what is he doing? Hey guys. Oh my god, the editors. Um, second game or scene of the worst show in the world. Huh. Are we good? Yeah. Like fully? You sure? I'm facing. Like good? So we're gonna play a game called Who Knows Me Better. And we know. Wouldn't it be who knows me best? No, who knows me better? But that's not like English. But really, <laughs> who? Wait, who? Asked. Yeah, thank you. Uh, we all know who's gonna win. Not gonna be Tati because she's a fake friend. Um. I'm a green one. What's my favorite color? Purple. She said it first. Told you. Point <laughs> oh, one. Like whoever says it. Whoever gets it right. If you get it right, you get a point. Okay. If you get it wrong, you don't. Cool. You guys understand that? I love you. Can you give us like a this or that? How are we supposed to just like... And there's only three, two, one, then we... No, it's... Do you know my favorite color? It's who knows me best. If you don't know my favorite color, then you should not be sitting here. Okay. What's my favorite color? Purple. Wrong! <laughs> Wrong! Get out. It's orange. Orange, purple. No, it's so not. So orange is purple. You don't... What color is my hair? Brown. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> yes. Okay. What's my favorite shoe brand? Why are you gonna look what I'm wearing right now? <laughs> they do a best designer brand. Favorite shoe brand. That's not like okay. Wait, $3,000. Are Nike, right? Yep. Mm -hmm. Nike. Converse? Wrong and wrong. When have you ever seen me wear Air Forces? More than once. Uh, every like, two like, weeks. Cowboy boots. <laughs> no, that's just and what that's I wear. shoe brand. Yeah, <laughs> there are. Howdy. Howdy. Hold on. All my rednecks or southern girls out there, she just said, what did you say? Run that back. I don't even know. Howdy. What is it? Howdy, bowdy? Howdy, bowdy. Howdy, bowdy shoes. Howdy, bowdy. Howdy, bowdy. 
cancel her. To be honest, watch someone like after this video come up with a shoe brand. Yeah, exactly. Howdy it's bowdy so boots. Bad. Howdy fish bowdy tank, boots. Fish tank, call me in. Hey, someone make that. I'll be a. I'll be an investor. Howdy bowdy boots. HBB. Oh, you want to invest now? Howdy <laughs> bowdy idea. boots. You no, know, it's my idea now. You not Mr. Like Yeehaw? <laughs> no, they are Vans. I um. You did. When? Oh, uh, Sunny? Mm -hmm. That was like four years ago. Come on. That was this time last year. La yeah, four years ago. Um, so, when so <laughs> yeah, it's when she was in love with me. Um, <laughs> she? You. When I was nine. She was always on my. I was like 13. See what I mean? Cougar. <laughs> it's my favorite food. Type of food. Ramen? Type of food. Like. Mexican? Yeah. yeah. Asian? You just wanted me to be wrong. You like Mexican. What is my? F I do, but it's not my favorite. What's my favorite food? Asian. Sushi. Chinese food. Sushi. I don't like Thai food, but I do love Japanese and Chinese. It's okay, my okay. favorite food. Mexican. Mexican would be in, in, up there, but it's not. No, it's like four one. I um, no. <laughs> It's like the fourth two. <laughs> no, it's four one. Question four. How many tooth gyms do I have? He has one on this side, so you're right. Oh. She was right. But I'm about to get another one today, so technically two, so she that gets the point. Oh she gets God. the point, Natalie! <laughs> Woo! Um, <sighs> I'm just kidding. Tiebreaker, and this is gonna be the, this would be like the most popular brand. It's the easiest, but these girls will not know it. So. What is my favorite pair? Cowboy jeans. Okay, you lost me at cowboy. I don't know you hot stuff. <laughs> you should though, like. But I don't. Are they like a, a jean, but like they sell it like other It's a famous brand, like I promise you, famous. Wrangler? Da ding I didn't even know that was a, like. Wrangler's right. That was very I'm impressive. I got that. That was very impressive. See, Tati, I told you you wouldn't win. Freaking right? She won fair and square. Told you, there's fake friends in life. Um, I've known her since I was like seven. Doesn't What's even my know my name? favorite color. What's my middle name? Mm. Fake friend, huh? What's, wait, but what's my middle name? I Hayden don't know. Taylor Summerall. Fake friend. <laughs> mm. She remembered that. She had to think about it. She knew it. I knew it because I call you Hayden. Heck no. He know I him. promise you, it's like, it's, it's Spanish one. It's got, it's not even close. You're not even close. It's gotta be more than three syllables. Do you want to know why? Because if you were my real friend, you would know that I don't have a middle name. Oh. Wow. <laughs> yes. Yeah, so, I never just got one. Out of so blue. technically, you've never told me your middle name. If you don't have a middle name, how could no, you have told you me your middle name? Like, I don't have a middle name. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and you could have just been like, you don't have a middle name. That's I feel like that always like, comes up. Yeah, but I was right. You don't, you've you never told me your middle name. Fake friend. Bye, guys. But she lied. <laughs> She's fake. She said she did. Show. This is the worst show. <laughs> uh, this is the worst show in the world. Cut. See you later. I love you guys. Come down below. I'll see you next week. <laughs> I hate this. God, quit.